Hello friends, today we will be discussing on cells of the nervous system. Starting with the supporting cells, or the glial cells which are the non-neuronal cells. Glial cells provide support and protection for neurons. Astrocytes are star-shaped cells that play an active role in brain function by influencing the activity of neurons. It helps in, recycling neurotransmitters, secreting neurotrophic factors, for example neural growth factors. These factors stimulate the growth and maintenance of neurons. The astrocytes also dictate the number of synapses formed on neuronal surfaces and modulating synapses in adult brain. They also maintain the appropriate ionic composition of extracellular fluid surrounding neurons. Next, we'll be talking about oligodendrocytes. The oligodendrocytes are the analog of the Schwann cell in the central nervous system, responsible for forming myelin sheaths around brain and spinal cord axons. The other type of cells are the microglia, they are smallest of all glial cells. They represent the intrinsic immune effector cells of the CNS, and underlie the inflammation response that occurs following damage to the central nervous system, and the invasion of microorganisms. This is an image showing a neuron along with its supporting cells. Ependema. In addition to the glial cells, the CNS has epithelial-like cells that line the ventricles of the brain and the central canal of the spinal cord. These are cuboidal to columnar cells with cilia and microvilli, and helps in secretion of CSF. Neurons or nerve cells are the structural and functional units of the nervous system. They are specialized to conduct electrical signals. This is an image showing central canal of spinal cord and associated ependymal cells. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe if you like this video.